What up everybody, Japanese wannabes here. Got Akiyama here. Shiro. And today we're going to be reviewing JoJo's Bizarre Adventure All-Star Battle. Now, first we're going to start off with the story. <laughs> yeah, the story. Which, um, for someone who hasn't watched the anime or read any of the mangas, which is myself, I was extremely confused about what was going on in the story. They did not do a good job on on giving you know, giving you guys info. I mean I get that there were eight parts to the series, but this game did a bad job of summarizing the story. Yeah. For it, like the sto the story was rushed. Like there was no cutscenes. It was just we'll give you a little bit of text. We'll give you what? It was like what? Um five to fifty yeah. Five to twenty little short little <laughs> yeah, short, short little, little uh, quotes about what was going on. Yeah. Like so and so gets his head cut off. So and so, uh, what did he, he, he bit off his decapitated hand? Yeah, or something like that. You didn't and know I'm what, like, was, what going the hell was going on. It would have went a lot better if they would have had cutscenes for yeah. most of this stuff. I mean, I mean, yes, the game would have been like it would have made it longer. Yeah, because it was only like a two-hour game. Right. For the story. Um, yeah, that, that was one of the main main gripes I had about the game. Yeah. Other than that, I liked it. I mean, other than, uh, other than other than the story, yeah, story mode, it was very good. And then, you know, tying the campaign into the story mode, which is like the campaign was like a boss. You yeah, were just basically you were like hunting for boss battles, and with your with your battery, yeah. like in your top right corner, you had a battery which was like yep. basically your energy. And it only and, it charges up after two minutes. Yeah. So and you gotta like wait. Each little, each little like segment Bar. of your battery yeah. will charge up every two minutes. You gotta wait a certain amount of time to actually get on to your next boss battle. That's that's actually pretty good. Cause I got, I got to go. You know, maybe I do need a bathroom break. It's like it's hard to get me off of these games sometimes. Yeah. Like, like and, um, it. it was cool because the campaign was like you unlock yeah. customization oh, yeah. items, costumes, and uh, colors yeah. and other stuff. But the thing is, I unlock stuff for characters I don't even have yet because they haven't been released. Yeah. But it's it's still pretty cool to unlock yep. taunt. You unlock taunts and stuff, and yep. it's but, pretty um, cool. Now, poses. now the graphics for the game. Oh yeah, graphics. it was kind of like a um, I like them. like the graphics for Naruto meet uh, Street Fighter Four. Yeah. With the cell yeah. shade, kind of. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it was like. Everything was like kind of like drawn in, and then it was like put in there. It was real, like, real, real, real nice. Game. I liked it. Beautiful. And it was like the and when you look at it, kind of like a two D meets three D a little bit yeah, almost, yeah. but it's still like um, it's like it's a free roam map like uh like Naruto would be yeah. or but Dragon Ball Z Budokai. That's one thing we got to talk about these stage hazards. That's one thing I don't too much like. They, they get pretty irritating. Like the first time, you know, it was kind of cool, but they put one in. If I'm not mistaken, they put one in every stage. And speaking stage, of stages, stage when I hate to go back to the uh, oh, talk yeah. about the story yeah, mode, that story but mode. for a lot of the story mode, like when you would do your individual battles, would say, "Oh, you go to Dio's castle to fight him," but you, you started in off in Dio's, in Dio's castle. castle. Yeah, it'll say, "Okay, uh, for example, uh, Jonathan." is being trained by Zappelli. That's the beginning of the series. I read the manga. They were fighting on, you know, in open land. It was like by a forest somewhere, by by a river. And here, they're in Dio's castle. Yeah, all right. Why are you training in Dio's castle? Like, so it was... They I mean, didn't put a lot of thought or yeah, energy into making maps or I mean, I get, it was, I get it was eight parts, so they didn't, didn't want to... I mean, but I the, know, But man. then with the eight parts, it was kind of like some of them were really really fast like there was one that only had three parts oh, right. to that's that's part five I'm, I'm yeah there track was there was only was. You, you went through and you went through three fights jolene you fight you fight this guy who's my favorite character you fight him three times and that's, and that's, that's it the end. but as in, in the beginning you fight as jonathan you fight zapelli i think you fight zapelli again and and then you fight as Zapelli. Yeah. And then, and then Zapelli fights Dio. And then you fight and Dio. And then you fight Dio. And then that's yep. basically the end. So it was. There <laughs> I was, don't know, man. But other than that. Yeah, other than the game. story mode. Yeah, I know it sounds like we're kind of batching the game. But other than the story mode, we got a pretty solid game. fighter right here. I like and it. I like the music because 
it, depending on yeah. who you were fighting yeah. would depend on what the music was. Yeah, every character has his own theme. I actually got a CD from the Japanese version of Order. That's where I got the statue, the cool little statue from too. Um, yeah, it, it's, it's got some nice rock in here. You know, I'm not a hardcore rock and roll fan, but I really love this music. Yeah. This game. Some of it was pretty good. And uh, the characters, how'd you? The characters. I'm um, your favorite character. But. <laughs> My favorite character is this little fat dude over here. <laughs> that, yeah, yeah, this that's little fat dude right you here. You can see it. That, that's his. That's my favorite character right there. And it's my favorite character. Yeah, the little I fat got, dude. I got the priest. He's got the. <laughs> He's a hero. Oh, like this is a serial killer. Hero. This serial killer <laughs> like tries to kill this girl, yeah. and he kind of like intervenes a little it's, bit. He's got a, pr a pretty good story. So I mean. This guy, he's never read the manga, yeah. never never saw the anime. How did how did you feel about it? Would it make you maybe want to watch the anime? Maybe um, you want to see the manga? It would, it would make me want to read the like read the manga or watch the anime right. just to know what they were talking about, so I could like understand, <laughs> yeah. and then go back to the game and be like, okay, so that's what they meant by this happened and that happened, and then they were jumping this part, and you know, it was just a lot of stuff that you were missing. Yeah. But other than that, I thought it was pretty good, and you know, my, um, so what would you rate the game out of? Uh, 10. Out of ten, I would do it out of a ten. Out of a ten, I'm going to give it. A, I'm going to give it a seven point five. You give it a seven point five? Like it wasn't perfect, but it was. A, it was a good fighter. I'm gonna say it was good. I would probably give it a seven, just because to me the story mode seemed a little lackadaisical. You're right. And with with some of the characters, the the combat seemed it seemed too simple. Yeah, you can tap. But, you can tap square, 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 and, and just, you can pull off like a. 30 50 hit combo. Hit, yeah, 51 hit combo with some people. With some people, and then Not with great. other people, it was like you got to actually like, kind of like, in, yeah. in, in develop a, a, your own. Lisa, little, Lisa is, is one of those characters. You yeah, got. like kind of like develop your own little combos and stuff with it. But other than that, it was, it was yeah, I mean, pretty solid game. I liked it. I, I'm, I'm hoping they're gonna come out with a sequel. I don't know how. I heard it sold really well in Japan, but in America, I was really surprised it came out in the U.S. because, yeah. you know, the animes. Has it, the anime actually hasn't even come out in the U.S. yet, but you can watch it on Crunchyroll. Yeah. So but, um, check that out, guys. Check the game out, guys. But um, anything I'll, else but you want to say? To me, it wasn't worth the fifty dollars. Off, oh, yes, fifty dollars in U.S. Like First it might have been worth like twenty-five dollars at the most. Uh, that's how you feel about it. I, I mean, because of the way the story was, I wouldn't have. And some of the characters are, I wouldn't have felt. I'd have felt a little ripped off for buying it for fifty dollars. I felt pretty good. I don't know, it, because, you know, I watched the manga. I mean, I read the manga. I watched the anime. So I kind of, you know, I, I understand the story. I understand these characters and their background. So I'm kind of, you know, I'm a, I'm a fan. This guy, you know, he just hops in into a fighting game. He doesn't do a good job of explaining the yeah, story. So. so there's really no reason for him to really like the characters. But the gameplay was really fun. We played yeah. some versus matches. Yeah, we played you played about, versus 20, matches. about 20 versus matches. It was about even a little bit. I got bit. some wins, you got some wins. About even a little bit there. But um, other than that, we, we, we thought, it, both of us think it was a fair, yeah, fairly well overall. I, I say game. it's a buy. I, I say you buy it. What, what do you say? I mean, not for this price, wait till it goes down. Either. I would say wait till it goes down and then get it. Right. That's me, but you would say go out and buy it now. But... You know, if you went out and bought it now, I would, feel, I would tell you to like watch the anime or read the manga so you knew right, what yeah. was going on and then go buy the game. Because a lot of these characters weren't even put into the story mode. That's what made me mad. But uh, anyways, I'm kind of dragging along, guys. Yeah, but uh, uh, see so, you uh, next time. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you guys.